Here is what the Alexander Stefan, the author, says about the laser brain interaction within the brain topians and about the immortality topian. Theoretical studies of the laser brain interaction include laser beams of ultra short wavelengths, or as it is often referred to as the photons of different colors. The interaction is focused on a particular brain center, which I name Topin, responsible for a particular dysfunction in the body, such as the centers of neurodegenerative diseases, the damaged brain centers, etc. The laser photons are guided through optical fibers, so as to reach deep brain tissue and control it. The precision is subcellular, meaning the laser photons of different colors can precisely interact with the specific targets within the cell such as organelles, nucleus, and other bioentities within the cell. The fiber optics techniques are used to study the deep brain tissue. In particular, the short wavelength lasers are used in laser genetic engineering, whereby the cells are genetically engineered and controlled by lasers. Laser neurophysics, laser genomic physics, and laser stem cell physics may bring revolutionary discoveries. The foundations for the physics of the brain and the physics of consciousness I hypothesized about the fountain of youth token as the hypothetical region in the human brain that controls aging process. The discovery of this region in the human brain would open enormous possibility to control aging process and age-related diseases by the use of the short wavelength laser techniques. It can even lead to the possibility of prolonging human lifespan, namely, to make humans immortal, so to speak. Might it be that such immortality token does exist in the brain? Laser light in various pulse operation techniques has been used in the investigation of the brain tissue in vitro, especially on animals, which is the research that can be applied to the human brain, although, not always. Femtosecond, picosecond, and nanosecond laser pulses are currently used. The benefits of in vitro research in the laser brain tissue interaction are enormous. The brain diseases can be studied from the viewpoint of physics, the preventive methods can be formulated in this manner, and the physics of the brain functioning can be studied efficiently in addition to the biochemistry of the brain.